today is March the 4th and I just ended a vlog and I am going to start a new vlog. I don't know what you guys can see. Um, I'm driving on some back roads. I'm about to go to my tattoo appointment. Um, and I wanted to vlog a little bit for you guys today. Let you know I'm getting my sl uh, half sleeve on this arm finished. Um, or close to finished. We have a, f a couple hour session. Um, so we're going to get that finished up. Um, and then after, if I have time, I'm going to go to Target and do like a shop in Target with me. Um, because I really want to go to Target. Um, also, today's super simple makeup that I did, um, I think I'm going to post it on TikTok and here on YouTube. Because it's su such an easy makeup look that I did today. Um, my eyeshadow is so, it's so easy to do. Um, sorry if the camera is shaking too much. I try to stabilize it as best as I can, but we're in the car, so, you know, limited. Um, but, yeah. So, today, plans are go to the tattoo shop, get my tattoo. At, I have to be there at 1.30. Um, and then go to Target if I have time. Possibly possibly go to the garage um to let my mom and dad see my new tattoo possibly this is if we have time i don't know how long the tattoo is going to last i don't know how many hours he booked us for um i i don't know any of that um so we, we we're just going to go with the flow but later on today um i'm going to go live making supper we're going to have pizza and um a big salad i i really want a salad today for some reason so pizza and a big salad it is um yeah so let me talk to you guys a little bit while i'm driving about some key things that if you're gonna go get your first tattoo things to keep in mind um and things to be mindful of that way um you get the best experience possible while getting your tattoo so if you're going to be sitting for long long um sessions like more i'd say more than like a couple of hours i would take a snack um and a, a sugary drink so whether that be a sweet tea a dr pepper mountain dew whatever just as long as it's got sugar in it and maybe a little snack like a pack of crackers or something like that now, I don't do that just because I I literally take a bottle of water and water is important too. Make sure you drink plenty of water before you go. Make sure you eat a good meal before you go because the worst thing to do is sit through a tattoo with an empty stomach. I've done that before and it just makes the whole experience, um, like, I'm not gonna say more painful, but you definitely pay more attention to the needle and stuff like that. So I would recommend the heck i just saw some something really weird um <laughs> so i would i would definitely um i would definitely say get you a good snack um and get you a good meal in make sure you're in a good mental headspace so i talk to my artists um we have a lot to talk about i'm a chatty kathy and we like to catch up so i do talk to my artists but if you don't and want something to do bring headphones and maybe watch netflix or youtube or you know whatever um so make sure you're also wearing comfortable clothes and also clothes that you don't really care about because tattoo ink i don't know if you if you're not familiar with tattoos you wouldn't know but tattoo ink is not it does not come out of everything um like, if it gets in material, I had a pair of Birkenstocks. So, this was my very first long tattoo, okay? So, I had a pair of brand new Birkenstocks on. And um, my tattoo artist, he's like, why are you wearing brand new shoes? And I'm like, because they're comfortable and cute. I wasn't even getting a tattoo near my foot. But, it, but some ink fell on it. And he felt so bad. But it really wasn't his fault. Like, ink, ink spills, ink squirts, ink drips um so it wasn't his fault at all he felt terrible he's like i feel like i have to buy you a new pair of shoes i was like absolutely not i should have known better but yeah that was 
that was funny so don't wear anything that you care about um and also make sure the environment that you go to you feel comfortable in and i feel like this camera is shaking way too much but make sure that um you know that you're in a comfortable environment as well as you feel safe and comfortable at that salon tattoo shop whatever um because the worst thing is going somewhere where you don't feel comfortable and having to sit there for a while so yeah don't take aspirin before you go don't take any type of blood thinners before you go because it's you're gonna bleed a lot more than normal um if you do so like avoid ibuprofen um anything that like any any blood thinner any blood thinner avoid it at all possible costs because um likely likely very likely um you will bleed a lot more not saying that it's going to be like a death scene in the tattoo shop i'm not saying that what i'm saying is you just will bleed a lot more than usual so i'm excited um you all didn't even see my makeup look for the day. I feel like there's something on the screen. Um, hang on. I feel like there was something on the screen. But yeah, so that's what I'm doing right now. We're going to the shop. I might take you guys in there. I might not. It just really depends um, on how I feel, but I'm excited. We're gonna go add on to my Halloween sleeve. I think we're gonna do like a Coliseum like um memorial type like i don't know what we're gonna do we'll see jeremiah normally knows what he's doing um everybody at the shop that i go to knows what they're doing and i trust them fully so yeah but here we go let's go all right so it is 5 30 um and i'm just now leaving wow that took he was like <laughs> when I sit down we always just get to talking and talking and talking and talking and I was like I was like we always talk and he said I know and I don't get a lot of work done I'm like I'm so sorry <laughs> so we just we talk a lot and he tattoos while we talk and it's just a whole big fun thing and so I'm just not leaving. Um, if I wouldn't have, we just catch up, you know? We just have so much fun. And um, I was talking about whenever I used to ghost hunt with Charlie and <laughs> he was like, seriously, bro. He was like, next time you go, he was like, shoot me a message and I'll see if I can meet you guys. But he was like, I love you like that. And so I'm, I'm planning. And he also, I also told him about us going to bingo yesterday. And I had so much fun at bingo. And he said, he goes, oh my gosh. He said, next time you go to bingo, let me know. He was like, cause I might want to come. And I was like, that's fine. That's totally fine. So that's, it's, it's so much fun. I'm being safe while driving, just so you know. But I did just finish up my tattoo. I'm going to get me something sugary to drink because I'm starting to get a headache. Um, and I noticed when he was gray washing i was bleeding a lot more than what i usually do so i'm wondering if it's my um like my anemia just and my fingertips are really cold so I, I, i'm almost like i don't know what's going on but i just want to make sure that i'm okay and that like it's fine but i normally like during gray wash i normally don't bleed that much but today um i was bleeding a lot so hopefully like my iron levels and stuff are okay um but i'm just gonna get a sugary drink and probably honestly a sweet tea because it's good and also um i have a headache so hopefully that'll help my headache um yeah so yeah that that's what's up now um yeah tattoo that was fun that was really fun anyway um i don't have time to go to tj maxx or anything because i go live at 6 30 today 
so I don't have time to go to TJ Maxx or any of that fun stuff. So, um, or I honestly don't have time to swing by the garage either. So I will probably just head to the, his house and um, cook supper and stuff like that. So yeah, that's what's, that's what's going on. I'm just gonna get me a drink and then go back to the house. Um, yeah. Uh, I love getting tattooed because it's talking to people who are like myself um, and very just like explorative and um, open minded and stuff like that and it's just nice it's good to talk to good people if that makes sense I'm not saying that you can't go to anywhere else and talk to good people I mean heck oh I just got my hair done the other day and it was great talking to good people there um, I think it's just all in who you surround yourself with and people you um, are beside that make your experience of anything worth it and I'm just rambling at this point um, I'll see you when I get home uh, I, do I have butthole lips? I probably do. Okay, love you. Bye. Happy Sunday, pumpkins. When I got home last night, I had to hurry, get ready for a live. We cooked on live. Um, then me and Charlie wanted to go to bed. My arm was hurting so bad. Um, and I woke up today, and I've just been cleaning all day. I went live, um... I've cleaned my makeup brushes, so we're doing good for ourselves right now. And now I'm going to end this vlog, go ahead and import all my clips to my computer and see if I can come up with a video for tomorrow. So that's what I'm doing. Um, I hope you guys liked this short vlog. It was literally just a couple of clips. But I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, let me know. Um, I might not even upload this, I don't know. Mm, so, I don't know we'll see but I love you all remember to spread love kindness and positivity to yourself and others and until next time stay cool and be you bye